Let's do this, boys. Take two. Okay, I don't know how we lagged out, being that we're all pretty wealthy people, even in this economy, but let's hope that was the last time. Uh, I know you all like to accuse me of using McDonald's Wi-Fi, but I'm not even at McDonald's. I'm in Trump Tower. I call the storm bow. Joe, we've been over this last time. It's my birthday, so I get the best bow. Well, if, if Barry's getting the storm bow, I call the void bow. I like how it's the most demanding of a, uh, of a good memory. Joe, you can have Wolf. Hell no, you're not sticking me with the lava bow. It's easily the most difficult to build bordering impossible with a terrible ping. That's okay, George, you can have Wolf. I'll do lava. That's noble of you, Joe, but are you sure? Hey, someone's got to do it. If I can run a country, I can build a wonder weapon. Uh, um, you haven't been running shit, Joe. You're just a figurehead. And uh, Kamala has been running everything all along. There is no way the uh, guy who falls asleep in literally all the meetings uh, is taking charge, and he is so senile that he actually thinks he's still running things sad. Maybe he's right, but as long as I don't have to build it, he's welcome to try it. At least Joe has his uh, dementia as an excuse for his stupidity. Not really sure what hers is. Well, actually, I have an idea, but I wouldn't want to sound sexist. Yeah, God forbid that ever happens. Guys, I got that yummy gobble gum with the three price tag drops. Thanks, Joe. I actually really needed that. Of course, you'd be using an overpowered gobble gum that doesn't even really apply all that well to this map. Do you really think you have any room to talk? You think I don't see you over here using a perkaholic and a shopping free? He's right, Donald. That's a pretty hypocritical thing to say. No, it's not. I just mean that uh, you don't want to be using an ultra rare mega on a map that really doesn't demand it. For example, you'd never see me run a Perkaholic on maps like Shadows and the Giant. Uh, because of their low quantity of perk options, I use Shopping Free uh, so that we can open the doors uh, and uh, feed Dragon Heads so that we can uh, obtain the bows at the earliest convenience. So it's not the same thing at all. Well, look at it this way. You have Perkaholic right, which means you have Mule Kick. So you have more reason to hit the box. Yeah, that's true. I guess if he can spare the alchemical gum, then that's fair. By the way, Joe, it's called a fire sale drop, not a price tag drop. My screen just turned into what the civvies I drone struck saw before they died. What did someone do? First of all, Barry, that's sick, get help. And second, I just turned on the disco Easter egg. First of all, it's already been well established that we're all pretty sick in the head in our own special ways. And second, why didn't you tell me you were doing that? You know, I like to hit that funky music jam. So we're all pretty sick and special. What's my special sickness, Barry? We don't have time to go down that list. Anyway, little bro just straight up took a trip to the 1980s for a moment. You said it, buddy. You know, I first met my wife at a disco. Boy, do I feel like that took a while. Yep, 11 minutes by my count. That's one of this map's few drawbacks is how you want to do your best to kill as many zombies as you can in front of the dragons. And of course, since there are few zombies in the early rounds and how the four of us are off doing our own thing, that was to be expected. You guys been watching anything new lately? I finished watching Tacoma FD on Netflix and I'm almost done with The Walking Dead. Nothing to report on my end when it comes to Netflix. But until recently, I had a subscription to Peacock and I saw the traitors in the new Abigail movie. It kind of scares me, but she's just so cute. And since she's an immortal vampire, you can't scold me for being creepy. That's what you think, pal, but I too have a Peacock subscription and I saw Ted the series and George Lopez. I saw those two shows in that 70s show. I still can't believe they didn't bring it back to Netflix since that's where the spin-off series is held. Speaking of Netflix, I'm watching the series Blockbuster and Mindhunter. In addition, I'm also watching The Last Airbender. The cartoon or the new live action one? Live action. I know it wasn't well received by the community being a bit too gritty, as if it's a Game of Thrones spin-off. But that's why I like it. 
It really depends on what you're in the mood for, though. Well, I haven't seen it yet, so no spoilers. I enjoy Mindhunter, too. I wish they would come out with a third season. I second that. I really do feel that shows like Bones, Young Sheldon, The Big Bang Theory, and Mindhunter are making me smarter. If only those shows were around during my presidency. You said it, not me, but anyway, have you guys heard that the Daryl Dixon spinoff is coming to Netflix? Uh, it's cool to see other parts of that franchise coming to Netflix, but I would have preferred Dead City. Are you sure you can handle crafting the lava bow? Because I'll craft it for you and you can use it after. Trust the process, Barry. I looked up a tutorial when we started. Why do you think my character was so still the first minute we started? So that's what you were doing. I thought you just nodded off again. I don't buy it. I know he's only doing it because I refuse to. But he tried to call dibs on the storm bow when we spawned. And then you guys tried to stick him with the wolf bow. I just know that the people watching at home will be wondering why such a weird direction was taken. Sticking the most convoluted bow with the most no offense, but incompetent president. So pop quiz time, Joe. What is the first step in crafting the lava bow after picking it up? Well, I have to go down to the rocket test part of the map and shoot a rock after the rocket heats it up. Uh, I, I just knifed the zombie over the, the panel for the urn. Uh, it's a good thing I remembered to grab the Bowie knife when I had shopping free activated. There's no way I could have used uh, a normal knife this late of a round uh, unless I had an insta-kill. Whenever I hop into a game of DE and I know I'm going to be crafting the Void Bow, I always make sure I have the three following gobble gums, Kill Joy, Crawl Space, and maybe Shopping Free. Yeah, that step where you have to feed the skulls with crawlers is about the only thing that Crawl Space is good for. Unfortunately, I forgot to add it to uh, my arsenal, so I'll be using grenades. Uh, at least they'll get you points. Man, how much crack cocaine do you have to snort to come up with these crazy steps? The one where you have to kill zombies while inside the rings of fire are about the only easy thing about this step. That's what I've been saying. The only difficult step to the wolf bow is shooting the dog head symbol and not missing the ledge. And even that one is pretty easy with enough skill and patience. Well, first of all, crack cocaine and ring of fire said in the same sentence as in the new Ozzy Osbourne and uh, classic Johnny Cash songs. In all of our time together, Joe, that might have been the coolest thing you've ever said. And for another, I will admit that there isn't much to complain about in terms of getting the storm bow. I will say that the urns couldn't be in the tightest spots of the map. If you ever use this crafting table, I have to speculate that you don't know what you're doing. The steps where you have to shoot the logs can be difficult with new players, but once you work on your coordination, it's easy. Anyway, looks like the first down goes to George. Shoot, I know you're going to blame it on lack of skill, but I just went down. Oh, it's definitely a skill issue, Lull, but uh, people down in this spot quite a bit, so I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. Anti-gravity is finally on, so I can grab my bow from the crypt. Taking it to the pyramid now. I really love how one of the steps is to uh, pick up three specific symbols in the form of drops to figure out the demon's name. Uh, as in playing the game normally as if it were BO1 or World at War Zombies. I love how my bow is a perfect balance of skill and memory, but it's not too arbitrary like the lava bow. Finally done with the ring of fire step, now to... I guess find out what the symbol is in the tower and find out what fireplace it's in. Now to find that symbol. I think that's it. I just got my bow going to the catacombs. Uh, I'm down by the rocket test site to feed my last urn, and I'll also grab the piece for the Ragnarok DG-42 while I'm here.
got the piece. Papa Panzer spawns in the next round, so we need to be prepared. I usually just use the lightning trap to stun him, and just as well, we need to do those things for the other two pieces. It's almost done, boys. Just need to pick up my bow. Well, Joe, I have to admit I am very impressed. If only you were as good at running a country as you apparently are at this game, uh, then you wouldn't have had to drop out of the, the election. Shot the last pile of logs with lightning, now heading back to the tower to get my bow. Know what? I need to go. Laura's calling me for supper. Hopefully that new speaker I ordered will be here soon. Happy damn birthday, Barry. No sweat, George, thank you. It's round 12, so I'm turning on the trap for Papa Panzer and the final two Ragnarok pieces. That's one now to check the sky for the other. That's got it. Someone build on the table by the pyramid. I've been meaning to say I like how for one of the shield parts you have to turn on the anti-gravity. Uh, anyway, you the Democrats are on your own. I didn't realize how late it was. Uh, happy birthday, Obama. Oh no, I just died and lost all my perks. No, you didn't, man. I got a phoenix up. Way to clutch up, Joe. How are you doing so well? I do my research, homie. Actually having a phoenix up while the one person left happens to go down is just a matter of perfect timing. Whatever, I'm gonna go camp in my little Sammy Bear's bedroom. Let me know when you're done with your bow. Okay, I'm going to pretend I didn't hear that. Got it now, I just need to get my perks pack. Found a wisp. You wanna to go to the teleporter just for the heck of it? Well, I guess it couldn't hurt. made at our lunar facility has only served to accelerate our I have no doubt lightning rocket lightning NPD will prove vital to deciding Barry help it's a scary Iron Man zombie don't worry my VP he's no match for the Democratic duo Barry I think my game is frozen why isn't the White House's Wi-Fi better than this was it you who lagged our game out earlier what can I say I'm a cheeky little scamp aren't I I should go anyway, it's past my bedtime. Happy birthday, my homie. I might have guessed it. Well, it's just me, myself, and I now. Well, I guess it's time to hop off. Be sure to like and subscribe.